Quill. Check. Parchment. Check. Extra ink. Check. Extra. Extra ink. Check. Is that everything on the checklist? Yep. Great. Now that we've completed the checklist of things we need to create a checklist, we can make my checklist of the things I have to get done by the end of the day. Ready? Ready. Item one. Create checklist of the things I have to accomplish by the end of the day. <sighs> my little pony, my little pony. Sure. Tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you're all my very best friends? How are we doing, Spike? Let's see. We've already dropped off your cape at the cleaners, returned the blackboard you borrowed from Cheer Lee, ordered new parts and quills from the stationery shop. Hmm, seems like we just placed an order for those a few days ago. Can't imagine why we go through so many of them. Sounds like we're ahead of schedule. What's next? Cupcakes! Oh. Uh, I only ordered 12. Oh, I know, dear, but I had an extra, so I thought I'd make it a baker's dozen. Oh. oh, that was very thoughtful of you. It's just some of the icing from the extra cupcake is getting all over the one next to it. See? Oh, sure. It's just that I'm planning on sharing these at a picnic later, and I don't want any pony to feel like some pony else is getting more icing. Oh, no, uh, of course not. Not to worry. I'll just move some of this one to... Hmm, I think I may have scooped too much. Oops, now those two have more. Let's just try this again. Hmm, no, that won't do. Let me just hmm, put some here, then... No, that's not right. Okay, we're on this one. Uh, wait. I'll just... Ooh, a little bit here. And here. And... Oh, yes. Much better. Okay. Time to tackle the next item on our... Oops. Looks like we're gonna have to add Give a Baby Dragon a Bath to our list. Very efficient. And a little bit gross. Hmm. Looks like that's everything. Almost everything. Triple check checklist to make sure we didn't miss anything when we double check the checklist. Uh... Check. Oh, I've been holding that quill so long, I've got a claw cramp. Good thing we don't have anything to report to Princess Celestia this week. I don't think I could write another word. We haven't sent a letter to Princess Celestia this week? Why? Is that bad? 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 Of course it's bad! I'm supposed to send Princess Celestia a letter every week telling her about a lesson I've learned about friendship. Not every other week, not every ten days, every single week. Huh? Where's my calendar? Where's my calendar? Where it always is? When did we send the last one? Last Tuesday? And today is... Tuesday? Mom! No, 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 no! If I don't send her a letter by sundown, I'll be... Tardy! What's that now? Tardy, Spike! Late! I'll be late! Oh, how could I let this happen? I'm usually so organized. I've never been late with an assignment. Oh, please. You're the most studious student ever. I'm sure the princess will forgive you if you miss one little deadline. I'm afraid to take that chance, Spike. This is the ruler of all of Equestria we're talking about. The pony who holds my fate in her hooves. What if she doesn't forgive me? Yeah, I don't think she... What if instead she starts thinking I'm not taking my studies on friendship seriously? Why would she... What if she makes me come back to Canterlot and puts me back in school and makes me prove I've been taking them seriously by giving me a test? What if I don't pass? But why wouldn't you pass? She's my teacher. Do you know what teachers do to students who don't pass? 
They send them back a grade. But she won't just send me back a grade. She'll send me back to... Magic Kindergarten. <laughs> Twilight? Twilight? Huh? That is the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. You're not gonna be sent back to Magic Kindergarten. You're right. I have no reason to worry. Because I'm going to solve a friend's problem and get that letter to Princess Celestia before sundown. Uh, so... Got any problems, troubles, conundrums, or any other sort of issues, major or minor, that I, as a good friend, could help you solve? Hmm. Hmm. Uh, uh, I got nothing. <sighs> then it looks like I'm gonna have to find some pony who does. Uh, this won't end well. You've got this, Twilight. You still have plenty of time to get that letter to Princess Celestia. Has to be some pony around here who needs the help of a good friend. Mary! <laughs> Don't worry, Rarity. I'm here. Why me? Why? 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 Of all the worst things that could happen, this is the worst of me! What's happened? Are you all right? I've lost my diamond and crusted purple ribbon! I have searched high, and I have searched low. Low and high, high and low. How can I possibly finish my latest creation if I can't find it? Never fear, Rarity. As your friend, I'll do my best to help you find it. Oh, there it is. Isn't it always just the last place you look? So, you just lost your ribbon? Mm -hmm. But now you've found it. Yeah. And nothing else is bothering you? Nothing that I, as a good friend, could help you with? Hmm. There is one thing. Yes? I think I left my measuring tape under the fabric over there. Could you get that for me? Uh, measuring tape. Sure. Twilight? Is there something bother... Twilight? No need to panic. Rarity is just one pony. I'm sure one of my other friends will need me. <laughs> She must hate her guts! So <laughs> wonderful! Rainbow Jack, stop! Listen, Rainbow, I know you're upset with Applejack, but don't worry. Whatever it is that has come between you two, I'm sure that I, as a good friend, can help you resolve your problems. Uh, what are you talking about? Oh, Rainbow Dash, you don't have to hide your feelings from me. I can tell you two must have had a terrible fight. Now, why don't you tell me all about your issues with Applejack? I don't have any issues with Applejack. You don't? Then why are you destroying her property? Because she asked me to. Right, Applejack? Yes, ma'am. I wanted to put up a new barn, but this one's got to come down first. <laughs> now get back to it, R.D. You got it, boss. I'd take cover if I were you. Stop! I wasted all that time. I should have just come here first. Fluttershy always has some fear she's trying to get over. As a good friend, I'll be able to help her. Of 
all the days she had to stop being such a scaredy pony, she had to pick today! What am I going to do? You really should have come to me sooner. You are carrying so much tension in that shoulder. <sighs> it's fine. It'll all be fine. The day isn't over yet, but it will be over soon. Ugh. It'll be all over. My time in Ponyville, my advanced studies. No, no, you're a good student. You can do this. Oh, but what if I can't? You can. You just have to keep it together. Keep it together! Are you talking to... yourself? Twilight? <laughs> Snap out of it! Huh? Are you okay? <laughs> Twilight, I'm really worried. I mean, this letter thing is really getting to you. Here, you've been so anxious all day that you completely forgot about the picnic. Why don't you just relax and go hang out with... The picnic! I should go see my friends. I'm glad you've come to your senses. Please tell me I did not forget the plates. I did. I totally forgot them. Of all the worst things that could happen, this is the worst possible thing! <gasps> why? 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 Uh, what? You didn't expect me to lay on the grass, did you? You all right, huh? No! I am not all right. What? Oh, no. I don't quite understand. Do. It's just terrible. Yes. yes. Simply awful. Yes. It's the most horrific trouble I've ever been in, and I really, really, really need your help. Yes. My letter to Princess Celestia is almost overdue, and I haven't learned anything about friendship. <sighs> oh, thank goodness. I thought something really awful had happened. <laughs> If I don't turn in the letter on time, I'll be tardy! Tardy! Uh. <laughs> no offense, Sugar Cube, but it looks like some ponies getting themselves all worked up over nothing. This is not nothing. This is everything. I need you guys to help me find some pony with a problem I can fix before sundown. My whole life depends on it! Oh, Twilight, you're such a crack up! Come on now. Have a seat and stop sweating the small stuff. <gasps> wow, I've never seen Twilight so upset before. Oh, what a drama queen. <clears throat> Relatively speaking. Clock is ticking, Twilight. Clock is ticking. Keep it together. If I can't find a friendship problem, I'll make a friendship problem! <laughs> hi, girls! Oh, hi, Twilight. How's it going? Great. Just great. You three look like you're doing great, too! Looks like three good friends who obviously don't need the help of another good friend! This is Smarty Pants. She was mine when I was your age, and now I want to give her to you! Uh, she's... Great. Yeah, great. I really like her... Me? She even comes with her own notebook and quill for when you want to pretend she's doing her homework! That's, um, great. Yeah, great. <laughs> I really like her name. I just hope the fact that there are three of you and only one of her doesn't become a problem. I'd hate to cause a rift between such good friends. So who wants to play with her first? 
Uh, you should play with her first, Sweetie Belle. You know, because you like her mane so much. No, 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 no. I think Scootaloo should get to play with her first. I'd love to, but, um, you take her, Apple Blue. Applejack says it's important to share. I gotta think of something. Think, 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 do I like think? <gasps> That's it. Ooh, you're going to like Smarty Pants, and you're going to like her more than anything. If you could just give her to me. Nope. Oh, no. Give her back. No, don't touch it. What's all the commotion about? They're fighting over that doll. That incredible, amazing doll. Y'all hear that? What in the name of all things oats and apples is going on here? Don't look at it! Don't look at what? My Smarty Pants doll. I enchanted her, now every pony is fighting over her. Why would you enchant your doll? Oh, I had to do something. I had nothing to report to Princess Celestia. I thought if I couldn't find a problem, I'd make a problem. The day is almost over. Not almost. Twilight Sparkle. Well, Nelly. The library. Goodbye, girls. If you care to visit, I'll be in Magic Kindergarten back in Canterlot. Magic Kindergarten? Canterlot? We're never gonna see Twilight again! Uh, what are we gonna do, y'all? Of all the worst things that could happen, this is the worst possible thing! <laughs> What? I really mean it this time. But, but I'm supposed to send you a letter about friendship every week. I missed the deadline. I'm a bad student. I'm tardy. You are a wonderful student, Twilight. I don't have to get a letter every week to know that. Really? Wait! You can't punish her! It wasn't her fault. I'm listening. Please, Your Highness, we all saw that Twilight was upset. But we thought that the thing that she was worrying about wasn't worth worrying about. So when she ran off all worked up, not a single one of us tried to stop her. As Twilight's good friends, we should have taken her feelings seriously and been there for her. Please don't take her away from us just because we were too insensitive to help her. Looks like you all learned a pretty valuable lesson today. Mm -hmm. Very well. 
I'll forget Twilight's punishment on one condition. I'll I'll it. It. From this day forth, I would like you all to report to me your findings on the magic of friendship. When and only when you happen to discover them. <laughs> Princess Celestia, wait! How did you know I was in trouble? Your friend Spike made me aware that you were letting your fears get the best of you. I commend him for taking your feelings seriously. Now, if you will all excuse me, I must return to Canterlot. I'm expecting some mail. Y'all heard the princess. Spike, take a letter. <clears throat> Dear Princess Celestia, we're writing to you because today we all learned a little something about friendship. We learned that you should take your friend's worries seriously. Even if you don't think that she has anything to worry about. And that you shouldn't let your worries turn a small problem into an enormously huge entire town in total chaos princesses to come and save the day problem. Signed, your loyal subjects. P.S. Obviously, Spike did not have to learn a lesson because he is the best, most awesome friend a pony could ask for. Unlike every pony else, he took things seriously and... <laughs> uh, yeah. I'll just, um... <laughs> <laughs>